As you know, John, we as Nottingham citizens have been working with your trust to co-produce a mental health stigma awareness session. We are delighted as this difficult year draws to a close to inform you that we have successfully piloted two train the trainer sessions. We trained 30 leaders from 15 community organizations across Nottingham to be able to deliver a 90 minute session within their workplace or organization. We had representation from the faith, education and charity sectors present. And already we are hearing of these leaders now starting to run this awareness section in their local context. We want to extend a massive thank you to Maria Paula Ditch for helping design our session and for Tony Mitchell in developing that further and through helping to train the trainers. They have both given hours of their time to co-produce this session with us and we are so grateful to them. They simply have done an outstanding job. We also want to extend our thanks to you, the Trust, for enabling this co-production work with citizens and by initially releasing time for Maria and Tony to work with us. Thank you. Next, we hope that those who have attended the Train the Trainers session will cascade this teaching down to their organisations and workplaces with the ultimate aim of Nottingham being a place where no one is embarrassed to admit to having a mental health challenge. With the funding for Time to Change coming to an end in 2021, we know this stigma awareness work is more important than ever. Our beloved son, Ben Cohen, ended his life on November 23rd, two years ago. He didn't want people to know he was diagnosed with a mental illness. He felt the stigma acutely. In fact, he didn't think his experiences were a result of illness, but were really happening. From his teenage years, he was sensitive to embarrassment, shame, being shown up. It may have helped if he could have talked more to his friends and relatives. And that's why we support Nottingham Citizens' Goal for Nottingham to be a place where no one is embarrassed to admit to having a mental health challenge. And why we believe the mental health awareness and stigma session Nottingham Citizens are promoting is so needed. Hi, I'm Percy Joe. Um, I'm a leader in um, a local faith community, God's Vineyard Ministries. Um, I attended um, the November Train the Trainer uh, session and I subsequently intend to um, run the training for our local church leaders. I, I find this training very, very timely because um, we deal with a lot of young people and we, in recent times we've had to deal with a number of um, um, mental health situations and this has equipped us um, to be able to identify the situations and at least know what to do about them. Uh, so we say thank you for working with um, uh, Nottingham Citizens. Hi John, Luke Goss here, one of the community organisers for Nottingham Citizens. We realise as a trust you'll be looking to develop preventative measures when it comes to mental health moving forward so as to help ease some of the pressures on the frontline services of the trust. We as organised civic institutions, as Nottingham citizens, want to work with you, continue to work with you in 2021 and beyond. So we've got a question for you. Would you be prepared to make a New Year's resolution to work with us to form a mental health community response task force? And would you be prepared to meet with us in the new year so as to continue this conversation? We've loved working with the Trust today and we'd love to continue that into 2021 and beyond. We look forward to hearing from you. Happy New Year.